my nuggets still catch catfish. Now today I'm fishing with a store-bought bait that is not the best catfish bait there is. However, this bait has a huge advantage over natural bait or anything else you can buy in the store like liver. For example, you've made it to the lake, you wanna fish for catfish, however, you don't have any way to catch bait and you don't wanna leave the lake to go to the store. So what do you do? Here's what I do. I just get in the back of my dirty truck and grab the fiber nuggets. Now using Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets at this pond is kind of a cheat because I know there's catfish in this pond and that they will eat Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets. After all, you need fish in the water to actually catch fish. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try to catch a catfish or two here, then I'm gonna go to a big lake and try to catch catfish in a big lake. Now don't mind the noise in the background, there's a birthday party going on in this public park. Now these pieces are so big, I'm gonna use half a piece on each hook. And it's falling apart. Here's the first piece. Probably should turn my rod holder cart around so I can use it. Here's the second piece. All right, we're gonna leave them locked down in the rod holders and see what happens. There we go. Fish on. Red as balloons are being popped. I will admit this has taken a while. But the last time they stocked this pond was in May. <laughs> Channel catfish on fiber nuggets. All right, this is a nice little channel cat. It might be a little bit too small to eat, but this is the type of fish that you expect to catch when using the fiber nuggets. Maybe I can make this the thumbnail. A catfish on fiber nuggets. All right, I'm gonna let this guy go. You'd think they'd be bigger than that when they were stocked in May by now. However, it is a little bitty pond, so I don't expect them to grow fast. Now that I've caught a catfish, I think I'm gonna move to a big lake and try to catch a catfish there. Just to show that I can catch catfish on this in a wild lake. A bunch of Canadian geese just landed. Hate to waste a half a fiber nugget, but I'm gonna do that just to move. Stay tuned. And here is the big lake I'm going to fish. Fun fact, somewhere over there, Top Knox Fishing lost his trolling motor. It's at the bottom of the lake. <laughs> well, I did bring a rod holder to try to stake this one down handle won't go all the way down oh well anyway I've fished this spot before and caught catfish and carp so hopefully I'll be able to catch a catfish or a carp on the fiber nuggets since I'm at the main lake I'm going to use a whole fiber nugget on each rod
here's the other one. I did bring a net just in case something bigger decides to drop by. That might help. I don't know. Also, the camera view is a little bit lower than normal because I broke a foot on my tripod. So I gotta buy a new tripod now. And to be honest with you guys, I've been calling these the bad luck rods because I haven't been able to catch good fish on them. These are some my buddy Clint let me borrow, and they're not a Kuma. It's a Daiwa rod and a Shimano reel. And you guys know that I am an Akuma fanboy. Maybe this marina will change the luck on these rods. I guess we will see. I think I have bluegill pecking at it. I saw a ton of bluegill out there when I cast these out. That's the second time. I know bluegill will eat this bait. All right, I'm gonna reel this up and see if there's still bait on it. Even with those hits, probably from bluegill, I still got bait. Hmm. Now I do have videos where I've caught catfish in a normal lake off of the fiber nuggets. So maybe today's just not my lucky day. Like I said earlier, these are my bad luck rods. I'm going to check the other one too. There's a lot of grass under there. Felt something. I still got bait on here too. Well, at least it stays on the hook really good. Now if a big enough fish would bite it. You guys can see I'm not alone. There's a swan here. And a few Canadian geese. Still no bites on my rods and reels. Okay, I do want to take back what I just said. I have been seeing nibbles on both of the rods. It could be bluegills, it could be minnows, who knows what it is. I am losing sunlight fast, so I'm just gonna give this maybe 10, 15 more minutes, and then I'm gonna give up. You win some, you lose some. I bet if I had chicken liver in the water, I probably wouldn't catch anything either. The catfish that I've caught around here are channel cats, and they eat just about anything. So for whatever reason, they're not in this area. That's how it goes some days. You get a lot of nibbles and no fish. At least the video is not skunked. Here we go. Finally got something. <laughs> it is summertime. A lot of times summertime is a nighttime bite. Old tail cat. Ow! <laughs> wow, he comes down really good. Channel catfish. 
and they do not stalk these guys in this lake. So there you go. Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets will catch a wild channel catfish, even though it did take me a really long time today. Now this waterway has a lot of blues in it, so the channel cats don't get that big at all. But I'm gonna put this guy back, let him grow up. Well, finally success. Even though it is really dark out, so you guys can probably barely see me. <laughs> I did wait quite a while to get that fish, but I'm happy that I caught him. Now before it gets too dark, I'm going to reel this one up, head back to the house and get something to eat because I'm starving. I think I've been out here about four or five hours, so it took a long time to get that fish. Now I do want to say this, Team Catfish is now on Amazon. They have their own little Amazon store. And from what I've seen, most of the prices on that store match their own online store. Back before the store existed on Amazon, people were charging exorbitant prices for Team Catfish gear on Amazon. So I'm glad they finally did it. And let me know if you want an Amazon associate link to that store. It's something that I don't advertise too often. I am an Amazon associate, so I can create a link that you can go through and buy stuff at normal prices and get me a small commission. Or you can just go to Amazon and look up Team Catfish instead of getting a link from me. It's perfectly fine. Anyway, as always, I want to thank you for taking your time out of your day to watch my video. I really, really, really appreciate it. I am hoping to get the boat out again soon and maybe get another big fish. Who knows? Thanks again for watching. Hope to see you next time.